and Dancing on Ice, a night on Broadway with the glitz and glamour of all our best love musicals. Our stars are nervously awaiting their turn in the spotlight. Next, it's showtime for Linda Lusardi. The thing that's missing at the moment is a little bit more skating, you on your own. We're taking on board what the judges have said. So we're doing a lot of skating um, on our own, which, which is quite scary, isn't it, for you? It's quite daunting, cos uh, I don't like letting go of Dan's <laughs> hand. And without the assistance of Dan's hand, Linda's finding it hard to stay steady on her feet. Oh, it's really f It's week four, and Linda really needs to skate more by herself and not relying on Dan all the time, if she wants to stay in the competition. Look at her. Might be next Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for your confidence there. But there's a welcome surprise for Linda when old friend and ex Dancing on Ice contestant David Seaman drops by to give her some encouragement. Oh, how are you? I'm good. Well, I had a lovely surprise today. David Seaman, a good friend of mine, popped in to kind of cheer me along, which is great because I'm feeling really stressed this week. And it was just nice to just break from it for a minute and see an old mate who's been there and done it himself. <laughs> oh, I've got a new partner. Oh, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> the reason I'm here is just to give her a bit of confidence, I hope. You know, and get through the weekend. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> Here you go. A real one. <laughs> Skating to I Know Him So Well from the Broadway show Chess, please welcome onto the ice Linda Musardi and Daniel Wister. to finish after the flick spin, but much more solo work as Linda shows that she can skate without her chest mate. Off the ice, these two are so close that they use the same toothbrush, hers. But she was doing solo sections, and there's the double dolphin, and the crucifix, which became an unsupported lay on the back. Here's the scores, 16.5 every week they've scored so far. Karen, four, Nikki, 3.5, Jason, three, Ruthie, three, Robin, 3.5. That gives them 17, their best score. Highest so far, well done. So, uh, are you finding this easier or harder to let go of his hand as the weeks go by? Well, I quite enjoyed that. I think I let go more often. <laughs> <laughs> Dan? That was brilliant. Really enjoyed it. I thought she did excellent. Good stuff, guys. Yeah, no, she did. I think um, one thing um, with Linda and Dan, they have this connection through the eyes as well. So he's always there even when you're not holding I hands, know, right? I, I can see that happening. Yeah, <laughs> well done. OK, judges? Thank you. Um, a great routine, but, Jason, for some reason, the performance scores are lower than the skating marks tonight. Yeah, that's right. I think what we are looking at tonight is that this is supposed to be Broadway West End, so I'm really looking for great performances and interpretations. And, unfortunately, that... Mm. 
that interpretation of I know him so well was a little bit more like I know him so what. Um, you started off so well and then it deteriorated because you could see when you weren't with Dan that you were terrified. And so therefore I didn't feel that you sustained the level of performance. Uh throughout the entire program. So, unfortunately, and I'm a big supporter of yours, but I did not feel the love tonight. I can I did feel the love. You. Okay, Karen, I you felt, were shaking I your head during that. There. I thought the relationship between you, it happens with Dan and his couples, you know? I felt the love out there because it's just developing between you. It's very soft. Linda, you have a lovely skating style, a lovely softness about that. So, I'm seeing more love than you are tonight, Jason. Good really? to me. Really? Okay, thanks, Gertrude. Thank you. Karen's voice is broken. Right, you know her so well, but if you want to see her again, she will need your vote when the lines open a little bit later. Linda and Daniel!